Hey guys, in this video, I will give you a walkthrough on how to use Gate.io. I will show you how to create your own account and how to verify your identity and how to set up your account security. Gate.io is a platform for cryptocurrency traders. If you are a crypto trader and you are looking for a medium to buy or sell your tokens or coins, I recommend Gate.io to you. They are reliable and fast. So now without further ado, let's get right into it. The first thing you need to do is go over to sign up and then you want to decide which email address you would like to use. To register your account and then you have to decide on your password. If you want to get a $20 free discount, make sure to enter the referral ID. And once you have done that, you need to click on the checkbox to clarify that you are 18 years of age or older and then you just want to click on next. You will then have to set your password. This is a password you will have to use every time before being able to buy or sell cryptocurrencies and you will also have to use this code before being able to withdraw funds from your account. So please make sure to not forget this code and once you have done that, you can then go ahead and click on create account. Now before you can actually use your account, you will see that you have to activate your account. So to activate your Gate.io account, you need to go over to your email and then you open up email and click on the link right here. You will see that your account has been verified and you will then have to log in into your account. And because of safety methods, Gate.io has decided to instantly activate your two-factor code. Which means that you will get a two-factor authentication code sent to your email. So once again, you need to go over to your email, copy the code, then you want to go ahead and paste it in. And once you have done that, you will be logged in into your account. You will then see the homepage of Gate.io. And the second thing I will show you in today's video is how to verify your identity, also known as KYC verification. So you just need to go over to KYC now or if you don't see this pop up, you need to go over to this icon in the top right and click on the KYC identification right here. You will then need to verify your identity now by clicking on individual verify now or if you are an organization, click on verify now on the right now to complete your KYC registration. You just need to fill in your country, full name, full name once again and then the rest of the information right here. Now once you have gone through the process, your account will be verified. Once you have actually verified yourself on gate.io, the next thing you need to do is to improve your security. So you need to go over to security settings. By the way, you can go over to the right here and click on security verification. And you will then see that your current safety strength is too weak. So to increase your security, I will show you how to enable the two-step verification and how to connect your account to the Google Authenticator. Now you need to go over to login, two-step verification, then you need to click on email code. So just click on send email code, then go over to your email and copy your code. You will now see that the login two-step verification has been enabled. And the same goes for the email setup login, which means that when you log in, you have to fill in your two-factor authentication code sent to your email. Now to connect the Google Authenticator, which means that when you log in, you have to fill in your two-factor authentication code sent to your email. Now to connect the Google Authenticator to your Gate.io account, you need to click on immediate binding. And then you need to click here, but before you do that, just a quick notice, TOTP code from the Google Authenticator is needed every time you use your Gate.io account. Do not delete it on your Google Authenticator or uninstall the Authenticator from your device. Now with that being clear, just click here and then you need to go over to your smartphone and open up either the App Store or if you are using an Android device, the Play Store. You will then need to go over to search and search for the Google Authenticator. Now just make sure to install the app and once you have done that, you need to open your Google Authenticator now. What you need to do is to go over to the plus button in the bottom right and click on the scan QR code. 
you will then need to make sure that you are scanning the QR code visible on your computer screen right here. It's not set up yet because when you scroll down, you will see that you need to fill in the six digits code generated in the Google Authenticator. However, I would recommend you first enter your fund password and your email code. Now, once you have filled in your fund password and the email code, make sure to go over to the Google Authenticator and fill in your TOTP. And then you just click on Enable Two-Factor Authenticator and you will then see that your two-factor authentication has been connected. Now that your account security is set up, if you found this video helpful, let me know by leaving a like or subscribe to our channel for more amazing tech videos. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.